Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to give an overview of what a hierarchical relationship is in Salesforce. Unlike lookup relationships and master detail relationships, a hierarchical relationship is a special type of relationship that is related just to the user object. It allows users to use a lookup field to associate one internal user in your Salesforce org with another user that does not directly or indirectly refer to itself. For example, you can create a custom hierarchical relationship field to store each user's direct report or direct manager. I'm going to go ahead and quickly show you how you can create a hierarchical relationship field on the user object. So from setup, if we navigate to object manager, and then this quick find box, we search user. We're going to click on the user object. From here, we're going to click on fields and relationships. And then we're going to click on new. So from here, we're going to select the field type of hierarchical relationship and then click next. And then for the field label, I'm going to label this coach. Oftentimes, larger organizations will assign employees a coach or some kind of support manager that is there to help employees that are newer to the organization and are there to answer any questions the new employee might have. For the child relationship name, I'm just going to name this coachy and then click next. Then click next again and then save. So now that we've established the relationship, I'm going to navigate to a user record. I'm going to click on myself. And then from here, I'm going to click edit. And if we scroll down, you'll see under the additional information that there's this new coach field. If we click this search icon, I'm going to select Elon Bezos. And then I'm going to go ahead and click save. So now if we scroll down on my user record, you'll see this coach field with Elon Bezos. This is the hierarchical relationship we established. So that's really all there is to hierarchical relationships. You can use them in a way to associate two users in some capacity. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you all for watching today and I'll see you in the next video.